And there is our race winner, Sebastian Buemi. For the first time, we go green in Beijing. And there's Sebastian Buemi just moving out of the way at frustration for Sebastian Buemi. Sebastian Buemi's going past his teammate Nico Prost. A strong drive from Buemi. Towards the second chicane, and Buemi's going again. He must have some sort of brake problem. Through turns 10 and 11 comes Buemi. PK Jr. is following him. Degrassi's not far behind. It's victory for Sebastian Buemi and Edams in the third round of Formula E. It's been very difficult, and now we, we finally uh, you know win our first race, so really happy. Oh, Buemi! Is he going to hit the walls? Oh, he's broken his front right, and he's out of the race. Oh, no. Sebastian Buemi, the Edams driver, is going to win the first Formula E race in Europe. Finally, a very good weekend from pole position to win. It's an amazing feeling, and especially in Monaco, so I, I couldn't be more happy. Buemi is using his fan boost, meanwhile. Buemi is past Jano Trulli. Tony Garn handing out the trophy to Sebastian Buemi. Oh, and he's going to come out right in front of Nick Heidfeld. The two of them right together. Buemi was in there for 10 seconds longer Something than he needed to be. Yeah, yeah. Edams have said that they thought the minimum pit stop time was 68 seconds. No. Not 58 seconds. And look at the times. No. Buemi, 1 minute 8 seconds. Nico Prost, 1 minute 8 seconds. Yeah, really disappointed with that. So we'll have to look at it internally because it was really uh, a lot of uh, lap time loss there. The penalty promoted Nick Heidfeld into third for Venturi's first top three finish but it means that Buemi is now 23 points behind Piquet in the standings and has it all to do if he's to claim the title in the Visa London E-Prix on the 27th and 28th of June.